In Mobile Legends, emblems give your heroes instant attributes that gives you an advantage in game. We're running over the tank, support, assassin, fighter, and mage emblem. But now, we're checking out the most popular role, the marksman emblem. My name is Brian, and this is Yucatec KP. Marksman is one of the most overused roles in Mobile Legends. And I don't blame you guys because it is also my favorite. Who wouldn't want a hero that has a long range and deals a lot of damage? It's also easier to play because all you have to do is farm and build a lot of items. Because Marksman is very valuable in the late game. There's also a big disadvantage though. Being your team's carry will make you one of the enemy team's main targets. In a future video, we're gonna teach you how to actually play the Marksman role. But for now, let's talk about the basics first. To be more efficient marksman, you need to pick the right marksman emblem first. And here are the 4 best marksman emblem configurations that can help you to become a more efficient marksman. So, for number 1. This emblem is best if you use marksman hero that mainly use their normal attack as their main weapon. Which means they always rely on physical damage. This consists of level 3 grid that gives you 5% increase in your physical lifesteal. This lifesteal will be a big factor throughout the game since you gain health while attacking your enemy. This also has a level 3 sweep for you to gain plus 5% of attack speed. Again, marksman heroes mostly rely on their physical attack, so if your attack speed is higher, then you can kill your enemies faster. And lastly, Electro Flash for the talent. This one suits best this emblem configuration. It increases your movement speed by 40% after dealing damage to the enemy with your normal attacks for 1.5 seconds. And this also regenerates your HP by 30% of your hero's physical attack. With this, you can easily hit and run your opponents. But take note that this talent has a 10 second cooldown. For number 2, this is quite similar to the first emblem setup. This also consists of level 3 grid that helps you to gain plus 5% of physical life steal. And also, level 3 sweep for you to have plus 5% of attack speed. As I mentioned earlier, attack speed is very important for marksman heroes. And for the talent is Weakness Finder. This one is exclusively for long range heroes. If you use this talent for heroes that are short range or melee, it will not activate. This talent gets you a 20% chance of reducing the target's movement speed by 90% and their attack speed by 50% when you hit them with your hero's normal attack. The best part about this talent is that it only has a 2 second cooldown. For number 3, this emblem will prioritize critical damage. So if you use heroes like Clint and Leslie who deal a lot of critical damage, this is the real deal. This consists of level 3 Fatal that grants you plus 3.60% of the critical chance that you already have. Clint and Leslie often use their skill first to deal a great amount of critical damage to the enemy. So to do this more often, you will be needing level 3 Mastery for you to have plus 5% of cooldown reduction. And get Weakness Finder for the talent. Again, this one is only for long range heroes. This talent is also a good fit for critical heroes because every time you hit an enemy there is a possibility that it will deal critical damage and the effect of the talent can be activated lastly for number four this last emblem configuration is best if you use marksman heroes that rely mostly on their physical items that being said this emblem can be used by all marksman heroes since they all rely on their physical damage which is increased by acquiring a lot of physical items. This one consists of level 3 grid again for you to have plus 5% of physical life skill and also level 3 sweep that gives you plus 5% of attack speed. And for the talent is weapon master, the most important part of this emblem. This increases the damage of the item that you bought by 12%. For example, if you get blade of despair which gives you plus 170 physical attack, that number increases by 12% which in this case equates to 190.4 so that's it for this video guys always be sure to pick the right marksman emblem for the right marksman hero i hope you learned a lot in this video and if you did be sure to leave a like subscribe to our channel for more content hit the bell icon so you don't miss any future uploads and be sure to visit yukatech.com gaming for more news tips and tricks this has been brian and see you again in the next one